Okay, so the clarity hierarchy is exactly what it sounds like. I'm going to show you a visual in a minute, but it's, it's a hierarchy, a pyramid to help you become clear about so that you can get closer to not only your priorities, but the path that will get you there with the greatest ease and velocity. Before we get into the hierarchy, though, what I need to do is talk a little bit about this idea of function over form. So how many people here, just by show of your actual hands, are familiar with the term form over function? So form of, over function is, is something that we talk a lot about. It's actually something that, in a lot of ways, digital marketing is built on, right? When you go to your average sales page, what do you see? You see a long presentation of all the features and benefits of the thing that's on offer. And usually there's this huge bonus stack and there's this whole plan or strategy around making the bonus stack more valuable than the thing itself that you're selling. You know, there's this attitude, this idea that the more that you can, more features and benefits you can put into something, the higher value it has and the more that you can charge and the more more people will buy it. That's a form over function approach to trying to market and sell a thing. The interesting thing about this idea of form over function is that historically it is rooted in the exact opposite. So the father of the modern skyscraper is a person named Louis Sullivan. And if you know you think about the, all the buildings that are part of the historic New York city landscape, they are following his architectural tenet that form ever follows function, meaning function comes first. And so if you think of buildings like the Chrysler Building or uh, the Empire State Building or the Flatiron Building or, you know, just think of your average bank. It looks like it serves the function of protecting your money, a big gray imposing intimidating stone building where you you know your most valuable resources are kept safe that's a function over form approach to building a building because you all know what a fan i am of ancient philosophy and spiritual traditions louis uh or i don't know if it's louis or louis but louis sullivan got that term from an ancient roman architect and engineer named Marcus Vitruvius Polio. And he wrote a book called De Architura, which is on architecture. And what he said was that every piece of architecture should follow three principles. It must be solid, it must be useful, and it must be beautiful. So the form, the beauty, comes after it fulfills being solid and useful it, after it, it serves its function. So the form, the bedazzling that you're doing to any offer or any item that you create is supposed to come after you, you make sure that you're serving the function. But that's not the way that human beings are wired. We're wired for more. We're wired for all the extras. And so even though more does not get us closer to what we want, because actually more only complicates and cruffs up a working system, we're wired to chase after that. The reason why so many digital marketers use this format of feature and benefit stacks and bonus stacks, focusing on all the extras is because it works, because it plays to our default human programming. So it's not to say that form doesn't matter at all, it's just that it doesn't matter if you don't have a solid foundation that it's built upon or added to. So you have to think about, is it useful for the intended purpose? And if you want to build some features and benefits on top of that, that can be helpful, doesn't necessarily make it helpful. So why am I talking about function over form when we're supposed to be talking about the clarity hierarchy? Well, I'll tell you why. 